I started here in January of 2020. I really appreciate my time as a laboratory manager, training students, as well as teaching them general chemistry and organic chemistry. I volunteered to be a lab assistant with Professor Carter for the experience. I don't have a lot of research under my belt. In order for me to get into medical school, they want to have that under your belt. So I feel like this will be a good experience for me to learn more. I had an enthusiastic high school chemistry teacher that really loved chemistry and was a college professor as well and got me so excited to pursue chemistry as a major. And I just wanted to share that same passion to my students so they will love chemistry as much as I do. I chose biochemistry because I want a better understanding of how chemistry works within the body and how it corresponds with biology. I wanted to major in pre-med because a year ago I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes and when I was in the hospital, the way the nurses and doctors care for me made me want to do the same. As an African American woman, it's important for me and others to study science at an HBCU because you are reminded of your rich history not just at your institution, but the rich history that comes with the color of your skin. And I knew that I was gonna be comfortable here and that I could thrive here. I don't like big schools. I like small, intimate schools. And when I saw everybody interacting on the yard and just saw how they really was like a family here, I was like, yeah, this is where I wanna be around people, you know, who look like me, who wanna be doctors like me, who have aspirations like me. It just inspired me to come here. While I was growing up, I didn't see a lot of people that looks like me that were chemistry professors. And so attending at HBCU allowed students to see people like them that came from their uh, environment to be more passionate about science. And it's also important to get out there into the science field to once again tackle that diversity gap to tackle the racial disparities that we face every day in the medical field, even in education. But when it comes to science department here, you really have a team. You really have a support team to back you up. They have wonderful resources like Labster. That was very helpful for me going through lab. But I just think it's just very important to get out there and to do it. And you have an institution like this that will push you as far as you need to go.